Wherever you have a large community of cars, you have an even larger community of car spotters that lurk in the shadows. So today, I'm gonna to share some basic car spotting etiquette from the perspective of a supercar driver. Car spotting is essentially a community of photographers, whether they use a potato cam or DSLR, that spot exotic and rare cars on public roads. And they compete for likes on social media. So here are some basic car spotting guidelines. Number one, ask for permission when possible. A simple question like, would it be okay if I quickly take some pictures of your car? is just a great way to disarm the driver because it makes your intentions perfectly explicit. And I get it's not always possible when you're getting rolling or panning shots, or maybe even intimidating to ask. You could even just do a gesture like, Look, I'll be honest and say, when people take a picture of the car while I'm driving, it does feel like an invasion of privacy at times. So a question like that just shows that you're able to think outside your perspective and consider the driver as well. Number two, ask car-related questions. A lot of questions that people tend to ask really come across as rude and offensive. Common questions are, how much does your car cost? What do you do for a living? Did you buy it, lease it, or rent it? When you ask open-ended questions, it allows the driver to engage in some sort of conversation. So questions like, what do you love most about the car? What's it like to drive? What's your favorite feature? Questions like that really just open the door for conversation. And let me ask you this, what motorhead does not love talking about his car? Guideline number three, avoid dangerous situations. So I've seen car spotters try and pull off some ridiculous stunts, like jumping in front of me while I'm driving, or hanging out the window just to get that shot. As important as likes are to you, I highly suggest that you avoid putting yourself or others in dangerous situations. Guideline number four, just be respectful. There are many ways you can demonstrate this. The manner in which you speak, Think of things your mom would remind you. Please and thank you go a really long way. And obviously avoid profanity. And you can also show respect through your actions as well by keeping a safe distance from the car, which shows that you're aware of your boundaries and you're doing your part to make everyone comfortable. If you want to get a closer shot, all you have to do is just ask for permission. It just shows that you're respectful and considerate. And that's all that really matters. Look, in the end of the day, we're all motorheads. We love cars and we love taking pictures of cars. It's just a matter of treating everyone with respect. And your behavior shouldn't change based on the value of the car. That's irrelevant. And these rules apply whether you're into muscle cars or hyper cars. So that's just some basic car spotting guidelines. If there's anything I missed, feel free to comment down below and let me know. Thanks for watching. Till next time.